Hey y'all. Okay, so today me and Shaniqua say hey. Hey guys. We are showing this wonderful, beautiful house. Just wait until you see the inside. Oh my god. It's a gym, is sunrooms, is about six bedrooms, five bathrooms. Maybe a little exaggeration. But hey, let's go <laughs> let's go inside and see. And all the people who like to work out, oh, you're gonna love the basement with the in, in with the gym and the inside. Oh yes. Uh-huh. I, I guarantee you this person got a YouTube channel. You can go find them because <laughs> they gym is too equipped for a house. Come with us, y'all. Okay, so first we have this beautiful living room with voltage ceilings. And voltage ceiling just means that they move the bolt, the joints of the roof so we can connect more exactly to the roof where you have higher ceilings, okay? And this, this is an add-on, but it is like a sunroom um, office. So I can get it on. Okay. It is not heated, but y'all, just imagine sitting in here when it's snowing and it's raining, you got your little wine, you just sipping. How comfortable is that? This, this is one of my favorite spots here. Okay, let's go on. Let, let's not bypass this beautiful fireplace. It is gas. I'm sorry, wood burning, I'm sorry. But um, it is wood burning, so what happens is you put the wood in here, um, you suck up, it sucks up the air and the heat come out this way. So it has to point it down so it won't disturb the TV and the sound, sound base. Okay, let's go over here. My favorite part, yeah. the kitchen. Okay, so this is the kitchen, right? So is it, is, I'm gonna say this is the eating kitchen because we have this part here. This is not the dining room. The dining room is over there, which we have not gotten to. But you come over here. I mean, for the size of the house, Thanksgiving won't be so great, you know, because you don't got that much counter space, but it is a beautiful updated kitchen. Um, you do have a little bit of cabinet space. You have a, a garbage disposal, dishwasher, and these knobs, I love it. The, the white and gold give me, it's giving fancy, you know, it's giving darling. <laughs> so that's what's coming. Come on, let's go on over here this way. All right, y'all. So now this is, this right here is the dining room, right? I love, 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 love how this light fixture here is. Wonderful. Wonderful. So like I said, off the dining room here, we have a small yet efficient deck where they have their um, electrical gas grill plugged up. So it's part hard, hard electrical, part gas. So that might be good. Okay, so the porch is for all types of weather, whether it's snow, rain, too much sun, um, you will be absolutely covered with this type of material of the porch. Now, let's get into the basement where all the goodies is. We got the water heaters, the electrical. That's that's where you know if you wanna, wanna how much money you wanna put into a house. Um, that's important, that's what makes the house run. That's your engine to a car. Let's go. Okay, so as we start to head down to the basement, I just need to show you guys this. How, how, how spacious is this laundry room? You know, as I think it's well designed, very spacious. We have updated appliances here. Um, it's real comfy, you know, I like it. I mean, I wouldn't mind putting a little chair right there sitting here doing my laundry. <laughs> so, in the basement. And um, our client is a therapist, so, you know, she has different rooms where she brings her clients. So this is a waiting room where she brings her clients. They sit down, you know, Watch a little bit of TV as they wait because our office is next door. The best thing about it is it, this house has forced air and so you see two bits there, they won't have to worry about being cold. But this one also has a wood burning fireplace as well. So they will always be nice and toasty as they wait for her to come and say, next. <laughs> now this is crazy. Like who really has a, like a gym that's equipped like this? This is why I said this person is a YouTuber guy. <laughs> Look at this gym. It's just amazing. All right, but let's, let's get to the nitty gritty of why we're down here, which is I told you we're looking for furnaces, we're looking for water heaters, electrical panels, okay? So here, we have a 60 gallon water tank here. Um, this is your water heater. 
Um, if you look closely, it'll tell you that it's a 60 gallon and it was installed in 2014. So that wasn't that long ago. These can go up to about 15, 15, let's say 15, 20 years if you take good care of them. Okay, and as we go over here, you have your central air unit. All right, we all know what central air is. This has been installed, well, yeah, it reinstalled um, just a few years ago. So they're actually in good shape here. As you turn around over here, we have the electrical panel, okay? So this electrical panel is actually a 200 amp. So normally you will see 100 amp or 200 amp. How we can tell? I'll show you. So you see this big cord right here in the middle? When it's that thick, normally that's a 200 amp, right? Now, you see the cord on the left hand side? That goes to a sub panel because this house is so big, we need a sub panel so we can plug up extra things so you won't get shortages. Um, that side right there is a 100 watt amp. Okay, so together, we have 300 watt amps of this for this size house. Okay, now, let's go on over here. I remember I said she has an office. Then, voila. This is her office. And look at this chair. So this is where they go. And you know, so that... You know, I really don't know what's wrong with me. Can you help me? And she's over there like... <laughs> mm, yes, my son, tell me what's wrong. And that's when you're actually like, that will you write? Nothing, just no, talk to me. Anyways, let me tell you what's wrong about this. I absolutely love this small little office. She actually utilized everything in her house. And I'm not gonna show you everything, but quick glance, how her accomplishments. So yay to my clients. But we can't show you her information. Let's go. We are in one of the full bathrooms here. Um, it has lights, it has exhaust, um, it has epoxy on the countertop. That's why it looks like, you know, if you, if you knock on it, it sounds like plastic. But they did a really good job because they wanted to make it look like stone. And that's exactly what it looks like. I'm gonna put some plants here. You can actually, if you come over, you can see over. So, you know, it's really nice. It's a nice little view. Ooh. You know, they have a piano. Like, Steve, you want that? <laughs> come on. All right. So, here is the massive bedroom, guys. Now, I think this room is absolutely beautiful. First off, I love the brick wall. Okay. Everything she has here is like, kind of like different look at the light fixture isn't that amazing okay so this room comes with two different closets all right one is bigger and of course it's gonna be for us ladies because we got clothes and shoes that we need so she got a little bit more space and pocketbooks to hang up and then you come over here and you know guys you know, we only have a certain amount of clothes so here's this it's here's his closet it's okay he can live that way it's fine and we come over here now the bathroom you would think that it stops here. It's a little tricky. You would think that it stops here and then bam. Look at this. Look at this. I love the step. So you got to step into the shower or into the tub. And the tub is actually pretty deep. What we're about to do is we're, we're going to do this part pretty quickly because it's only the bedrooms here. But I just want to show you how it's designed. So we'll go this way first. Here's the baby's room. Sir. Okay. Love the wall. Love the little black baby. Okay. And and we're off. Next room we go to. Okay, so here is number three. Bathroom. It's full. This is more of the kids' bathroom. As you can see on the wall, they got the little uh, colorful duckies and stuff like that. So um, that's number three. And then we come over here. Okay, this is also semi-teenager. Preteen, 12 years old, bedroom here. This is the baby boys. And last but not least, we have our teenager. And here's her pretty room. Okay, I love the carpet. I'm not gonna step on it. But look at how, look how cute her hammock is. It's adorable. Okay, and now, last but not least, we will go outside and show you um, the, the acreage. Um, the space of it and wrap up our video. Come with me. Okay, so we are seeing the backyard.
and it goes all the way back so they actually have about one acre of land and you can pretty much just do whatever you want to do back here it's a nice quiet area my favorite part of the backyard because how comfortable does this look And this is the end of our video. Thanks for being here with us, guys. If you have any questions, um, click the link below. It will tell you my number. Um, or you can inbox me if you have any questions. And you guys have a great day.